Yeah, Hendon, I know that, you know, sometimes you, you go into most games, right, and you feel pretty confident about the game plan, but did you have any idea going into this one that, that y'all were going to be that sharp offensively? Uh, that's what we aim for every game, uh, to come out and execute at a high level. Um, and anything short is, is a disappointing day. So, uh, David and then Patrick Brown. Hendon, can you just talk about your comfort level in that first quarter? I mean, it's 28 to 3. Y'all have 217 total yards. It just looked like everything was clicking. How how comfortable were you out there? And was this one of your favorite games of your career? Um, you know, playing football every game is my favorite game. Um, just enjoying it. Uh, I'm extremely blessed to be out there playing. I was really just taking it one play at a time and um, approaching every play in its individual play. Patrick and then Mike. Yeah, Hendon, you, this is your, I think, third straight start. Just how, how much more comfortable do you feel in this offense with the guys around you compared to kind of when you first came in as a backup? I mean, uh, every day we prepare, every every quarterback prepares as the starter. Um, eventually, uh, throughout the practices throughout the week, um, everyone will get to distribute the ball, throw the ball um, to the starter guys. Um, really, um, just coming out and those guys rallying around me uh, has been a special moment. Um, just Keep pushing forward from here. I guess, do you do you, do you feel like the the bet the, you know the guy for this team right now the guy quarterback you feel like you're pretty much entrenched yourself as uh, as the guy. Uh, I'm just here to help my team win ball games, however that may be. Um, so at the end of the day, we're just keeping our head down and working. Yeah, Hendon, what was your view of of Tyon's 92 yard run? Like, when did you kind of see him break outside, mm -hmm. and and what did you see, and then? Just overall, what allowed you guys to have so much success on the ground? Yeah, uh, it all starts up front. Uh, the guys up front had a great day. Um, they really, they were really explosive off the ball. They communicated well up front. I could hear them um, while I was calling the play. I can hear them point out who they're going to. Um, so hats off to them for having an incredible game. And um, you know, Tyon's a bad man. Uh, him just bre him breaking it and getting to his his top speed in no time. Um, he's he's just he's just amazing to watch. We'll go to Matthew Ray and then Adam Sparks. And then when you um, are able to get the ball out in the flats to guys like Valus and Jimmy Callaway and let those guys make plays for you, how much more of a comfort level does that give you knowing that you can take those shots down the field and then come back to those guys when you need them? Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> like I said before, I'm just playing out each play. Um, if my read takes me to throwing it to them short, um, then, you know, they're, they're playmakers. Those guys get the ball in their hand, and they're incredible. Um, so I'm blessed to have them around me. Uh, they also run great routes and are open um, almost every play. So, um, you know, it's just a blessing to be out there with those those playmakers. Um, and we're just moving forward and working hard uh, to improve our efficiency uh, going forward. Hendon, you guys scored really, really quick in tempo in that first quarter. How, how much of the pregame discussions were about attacking in this game? Um, not really. Uh, that's our that's our mindset uh, going into every game, every practice, play with tempo, and um, you know just be efficient in every play. We'll take two more. We'll go back to West and finish with David. Yeah, Hendon. A couple couple quick things. One, when did you know this week you were going to be able to play? Um, really, just just taking reps throughout the week. Um, they gave me the go ahead um, a day or two ago. Um, that was that I was good to go. Um, the docs gave us the nod, so um, we got things rolling. And also, I know that you know you're not the only guy who's been banged up. There's a lot of guys on the team that have been banged up, and especially up front offensively, there's been a bunch of old linemen who have gone down with different mm -hmm. things. How nice was it to to go out there and have that kind of performance despite all those guys on the offensive line being hurt? And what do you think of the guys that were out there? Uh, you know, everyone played great today. Um, you know, they all come in with the same mindset to work hard and get better each day. So we're all just growing together, um, trying to get better day in, day out. Hendon, you heard uh, Coach Eiffel say you want to get as good as you can, as quick as you can. What, what do you think today did on that front? It, it definitely uh, gave us a boost. Um, we got some things to uh, go back in and, and tighten up. Um, but, you know, on the bright side, uh, we got the win. That's the most important thing. And, um, at the end of the day, everyone gave it their all, and uh, that's all we can ask for. Thanks, Hendon. Yes, sir. Well, Jalen McCullough here. Finish things up in a minute or two, guys.